Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be talking about everything new they added in Chapter 5. Now, if you guys don't know already, Chapter 5 came around with a whole lot of stuff. And the first thing they came out with is actually something you can do very easily. So let's see what we got. Okay, so basically what these are called is they are called Match Quest. Now basically what match quests do, it says choose one quest to complete in this match and this match only. Now this is something you can only do in this match and it rewards you 5000 XP per one of these you can do and you can do one every single match. So if you think about it, if you play like 10 matches and you do one every single match, that's like hella XP right there. It's just, it's so free um, and very simple to do. So like make sure you guys are choosing these quests and trying to complete these especially if you're playing pubs but um yeah so that's the one new thing they added in the new season they added match quest very easy to use now another thing they actually added was of course the map they changed the map and everything but they also changed the movement as i will demonstrate this throughout this whole entire game so just take a look at the movement as almost every player knows already that the movement sucks i like it it's more realistic but i don't like how slow it is if it was less slow it'd be really good but it's just way too slow that's my only complaint um but other than that guys i think it's pretty good um but yeah so i don't know why this kid's landing here i'm trying to stay away from people here so i can make this video but this kid is landing on me for god knows why Alright, buddy, come get crapped on. Come on, please. Oh my god, you're so bad. Let's fucking go, guys. Let's fucking go. Okay, so, um, they added some cool things. Okay, now, what I want to talk about is an actually a new mechanic they added. Now, this is different from what we've ever seen before. They changed mantling. So, basically, by they changed mantling, is this is I'm going to show you what they did. So you still mantle normal, but if let me build some walls up like this, and once you do so, what's gonna happen is you see those like blocks that are showing up on the um, builds that I'm making. Um, blocks actually like appear like rectangles, I guess you could say, and you can actually climb on those, having you um, climb all the way up walls. So you can actually climb walls now, as I'm demonstrating right now. Um, very simple to do and you can do it in no builds and in builds because in no builds um it'll be like if it's a two-story building or higher there those will be on the building and you can climb those but um as you can see you do take full damage when you do it um as i demonstrated so yeah just be aware of that another thing i want to talk about is their healing as you guys can see you can move while you heal pretty simple but also very unique because we haven't seen that since fortnite came out so you can now move while you heal, which I think is a very, very cool thing they added. Now, another thing I want to talk about is actually um, these berries up here. Now, these are these berries here are actually called flow berries. Now, what these berries do is they allow you to get low gravity, and they also heal you for 10 um, shield at a time. And I know that doesn't seem like a lot, but trust me, these berries are actually pretty good. Um, so as you guys can see, I just consumed two berries and got 20 shield. And I got the low gravity effect, which is actually very, very cool. So now, what I'm going to show you guys is um, a few more things that they added. So the next thing I want to talk about is how um, the bullets and the riot shield work. So basically... If you guys don't know, they changed the bullets and they also added a riot shield. Now, both of these are actually pretty good. Both these changes are pretty good. I don't like the bullet drop that much. Alright guys, anyway, that's enough yapping. Let's get to it. So, first up, let's talk about the bullet drop, okay? Now, the bullet drop is actually very dumb because, as you guys can see, whenever I shoot my weapon, the farther it is, the more the bullet will drop. As you guys can see, the bullet is actually dropping the farther it goes. If you look very closely, you can see the bullets actually go down. They don't fly straight anymore. Now, this affects the sniper, the SMG, the AR, and um, that's about it. It also affects this pistol here and either pistol but um the only thing it doesn't affect is the shotgun so you guys don't have to worry about that now let's talk about the riot shield 
as you guys can see it does 150 damage per um attack now this is a very useful thing but be aware if you do um get shot while using this as you guys can see i'm using it as cover if you do use it as cover and your cover gets shot you will be stunned for like a few seconds but overall very good rotation here um very nice item pretty fun to use as well and it's also very unique i like what they did with this i feel like they could have made it a little better if they just um added some different things you could do with it it's kind of bland but overall pretty fun now the next thing i want to talk about is these clingers now basically what these clingers are called they're called cluster clingers now as you can see they took grenades and clingers and they made them have babies and basically this is a grenade and clinger but combined if you look very closely you can see the grenade grenades on the clinger so it's a clinger with grenades attached to it um, as you can see that's in my hand right now um, it's like five grenades with a clinger now if I throw this at the tree you guys will see how the grenades react the grenades will spread out and blow up everywhere so they blow up in all different angles and they hit for 30 per hit now that it does a lot of damage I can't even tell you guys how many times I killed myself with this item but trust me it's a very very good item now since we're getting close to the end of this video um, I just wanted to remind you guys to like and subscribe bring the bell for post notifications because I've been uploading a lot recently about the new season and these videos take a while to make because I got to get the content and everything like that so if you guys could drop like and subscribe I'd really appreciate that now here are those berries again as you can see not very very rare um, the next thing I want to talk about is actually cars um, they added cars that are new they added the um, Lamborghini um, the Ferrari and they also added this big truck and I actually forget what it's called but first I'm going to show you the um, this car right here now this one is called the license plate says super fast and it's called the whiplash now this car was in the game previous seasons but it is a pretty good car it moves very fast but to counter how fast it goes they make it have um, only 800 health so if you think of having only 800 health while you're being sprayed at and you're a big moving purple car um, that health isn't gonna last too fast especially if you're playing on a team mode um, but we do have this car right here. Now this is my personal favorite. It comes with a whole lot of cover because it's a bulky car. So you have more room. Alright guys, well that's going to be about it for this video. Um, I'm pretty sure I covered most of this stuff. Most of the stuff is pretty basic. I'm going to just let this kid kill me real quick. And there we go. <laughs> no way he's taking that. That's actually crazy. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.